If we push east, I think we can be back in Skynet territory by nightfall. Wait, I thought we were headed back to base. Not until we've rescued David and the others. <laughs> You're actually gonna go through with this stupid plan of yours? I'm not leaving them to die. You're putting my life at risk and hers because you have a guilty conscience? Hey, if it was you that was stuck out there and needed help, you'd want us to do the same for you. No, I wouldn't. I'd be dead, just like they're gonna be. John, T-70! This isn't working. At the rate we're moving, we'll never make it to Eagle Rock. So let's call it a day and head for base. You know, where it's safe. We need to change our perspective. He's got a point, Angie. Try and be less negative. Excuse me? That's not what I meant. Look, if we can get to the top of that building, we'll be able to see where all of Skynet's patrols are. We can plot a route back to Eagle Rock that avoids them. You sure it's safe? Angie, we're in a war zone. Not right. It's a trap! Keep him distracted! I'll take him out! Is it dead? Looks like it! That's the last of them. Nice work. Never seen endos like this before. Looks like they're coated in some kind of rubber skin. It's an early model infiltrator. Designed to blend in with the Resistance and destroy us from within. Rubber skin on a T-600. Easy to spot, but the 800s, they'll have real human skin. What are you talking about? We should go before any more of them show up. Come on, Connor. What's an 800? What do you know that we don't? <laughs> 